Hey guys, Satire Pie here, and welcome to Journey to the Max episode 24. And straight in with 95 Dungeoneering, which is um, somewhere I never thought I'd ever get to, but I guess it has to be done. Um, four more levels to go, which would probably take me the longest of all my levels, probably. Um, I just need to keep on going, not get distracted. Anyways, um, going on to 90 something construction. 97 construction, yay! Again, something I didn't think I'd ever get, and I've given up on stealing creation hammers now, but I'm just going straight out with planks. Um, yeah, it's boring, but I, I'm getting there, I mean, I'm getting there slowly. And um, another thing, I honestly, like, if you had asked me a year ago if I'd be anywhere this close to max, I would have said no. You've just seen 98 runecrafting. Um, it's insane. And we're going to go straight into this thing right here now um, when I'm gonna get another level for you and um, firstly I've got to explain this this is the live commentary now so it's gonna be boring I'm gonna babble loads of crap as I do um, in every video if you haven't watched my other videos um, so yeah feel free to just slap me in the face and go away um, I firstly have to say my Turtle Beach headset broke which is now you're hearing which is now why you're hearing really terrible sound and probably tons of static but um, I mean I guess, I guess it's better than nothing right um, this is just a really cheap pair of headphones a headset and, and mic thing until I decide what other headset I want to get because I'm not sure if I want to get another Turtle Beach because honestly it, it lasted just a couple of months so I, I just don't know what the point of buying a Turtle Beach is now so I'm, I'm gonna do some research and find out what headset I want Anyways, this lovely bank of XP that we got, I haven't used any of yet, but that's going to change. Actually, no, it's not. I'm going to do squeal first. Why did you make me move, stupid click-through chat? Runecrafting. Meh. Small XP lamp. Ah, man. I was hoping not to have to use my um, XP thing. Oh, well. Okay. Runecrafting is good anyway because I need runecrafting XP. I don't know why does it keep clicking here. I don't want to click there. I'm gonna get back in the bank. Go in the bank. Go in the bank. I've got a cold coming as well. Terrible, terribleness. It's pretty sweet. And hunter. Look how close to a hunt level I am. That's insane. Right. Okay. So we're gonna get. How much is that? Do we need? Meh. Meh. 25k. Let's do it. Hunter. And there we go. We have 94 Hunter. Which is nice. 2461 total now. I'm so, so close. I'll tell you what I just have left. I have um, 535k uh, runecrafting XP. 2.2 um, mil con xp i'm 97 um 3.7 mil dungeoneering xp because i'm at 95 um just 805k mining xp which i'm only doing by citadel now and i'm going to use my clan ring up um, for, for redstone and stuff um 377k woodcutting xp so i'm very close and obviously 5 million xp hunter which is going to take just as long as dungeoneering probably. I, um, I need to get into hunting. It takes me a while to really get into it. Anyways, <laughs> um, that's basically what I've got this this, this last couple of weeks or so. Um, yeah, 14 levels away. That's insane. Again, if you'd asked me last year if I was ever going to get Max Cape, I would have said, no way. But anyways, then there's another couple of things that I want to address. If you're watching this and have never watched my videos before, apart from one, probably, maybe. Um, this is my Journey to the Max videos, a kind of a chance for me to babble about me and my channel. And my RuneScape account. And I've recently got a fair few subscribers, basically doubling what I had before. I had about 450 subscribers before, and then um, I submitted a video to Chris Archie on the recommendation of one of my subscribers, and it got put on his channel, and then I got floods of troll comments and nice comments and subscribers, which I'm not moaning about. It's it was it's great, but um, I'm just letting you know this is what's it. So hi to all the new subscribers if you're actually watching this, and um, hi to all my old subscribers. 
hopefully who are watching this. Anyways, so what I think I'm going to do, because I'm not that far off a thousand subscribers, maybe about 50 or so, is at a thousand subscribers I'm going to do a question, and a question and answer session, because it's about, oh, I need something to do for a thousand, it's kind of a big accomplishment. I was insane, I was insanely shocked that I got a hundred back, way back in the day. Anyways, wow, I sound like a 13 year old boy, I'm aware of this, my throat is killing me. <laughs> um, let's just take some water. So I haven't used my insta kill dots. My death touch dots. I don't know why they just didn't call them insta kill dots. Um, and I don't. I guess I should use them on next, but I don't. I only have one part of the frozen key, and I don't have ceremonial, which is not a problem. I could easily get around that, but I'm lazy, as you might know, and I can't be bothered to do it. So I think I might just leave them in the bank and then um, <coughs> go get them before they run out. I think they run out like the thirty first of December. I think like that, something like that. And um, a good thing that came out of these darts, which I'm going to tell you about now, is torso seeds. They've dropped kind of dramatically. I bought these for about 270k each, and I'm farming them. Um, I brought 100 and 300 snapdragon seeds. So you should make a profit, and if you don't make a profit out of them, can, if you have jujus, um, juju farming potions, a high farming level, and um, master f master green fingers or just any green fingers, you should be making good profits out of these. And the dungeoneering scrolls would be great too. Um, last time I brought torstil seeds really cheap. I bought them about 280k each, and I managed making I, I I managed to make two uh, 20 mil off just um, 100 torstil seeds. So yeah, that's where my cash has gone. My cash has gone into seeds. I'm going to keep them in my bank until they basically rise. Which is a uh, should be happening, I guess. It might have to wait a couple of months, but oh well. Um, I don't think I have anything to say now. It's kind of boring and going on already, but um, yeah. So I was thinking of using the death touch starts on QBD, but I figured that's probably a waste. I haven't killed QBD yet, but I don't really doubt my ability in doing so. I just I've been preoccupied with with skilling at the minute. So yeah, plan for this week, um, I'm going to get woodcutting, mining and runecrafting down to about 150k away from 99. So I'm not going to be getting any skills this week, I'm just going to get them right up until 99 and I'm going to keep them there for a while. But yeah, um, I've also decided to do, oh wait, no, mining. <laughs> I've decided to do mining just by the Citadel, which will take a couple of weeks. Well, it'd take eight weeks, but I think I might just leave that and just do it up in... Yeah. Shut up, Rachel. I'm babbling crap that doesn't make any sense. Anyway, so I just thought I'd let you know that I'm still here. My headset is broken, but I've got this crappy new one. And I hope the sound's mildly okay. And um, I really need to just redo this video again. It's poo. Bye.